empowered by women. I think it is a world that thinks much longer term. I think women by nature think across very, very different generational time scales. And I think that's a lot of it's driven from our role as mothers, as sisters, as grandmothers, as aunts, as daughters. Um, I know men have it the same, you know, something similar, but I don't think it's quite the same. I think women actually have that inherent instinct that tries to protect and nurture over these longer time horizons. And I think it's something that's really needed in business and policy making and investment and in entrepreneurial ventures that are starting up. So I think that's really what women powered enterprise looks like to me. Well, I do think women have a unique contribution to make. W women have, uh, that we, we bring to uh, social change and an understanding, an intuitive understanding about what it looks like when it's fixed. So, and, and therefore we bring with us a very strong sense of, of, of dissatisfaction with the current status quo. And I, and I suspect that that's what's going to lead to change, is, is our dissatisfaction that the world isn't the world that we want to live in and we want our children to grow up in. Women have historically been the context keepers. You know, we were the oral story collectors, we were the weavers, we were the gatherers. And I think we're doing that now. I think, I think events like this are actually very much about that, where we're gathering and we're weaving a world that is fundamentally different. And I, I think the lack of women playing an architectural role in designing systems is part of the downfall. Um, I think men bring really important, strategic, linear things to the world and they have their place and they have their value. But I think we've overvalued that particular way of being in the world and we've undervalued what is essentially a feminine way of being and knowing and thinking. And I think this is a moment in time where that's shifting and all of a sudden sort of bubbling up, you know, almost like water from the stone is this this wellspring of women that are creatively saying, enough, okay, we're not going to stand on the sidelines and complain, we're going to actually become leaders and architects of a very different world. <laughs>